You're starting your first IT job. First of all, congratulations. Welcome to the field. It's gonna be a fun ride. One of the biggest questions that I always get asked from people who are starting their first IT jobs is, what do I need to know? And the short answer here is everything and nothing. Now I know that was kind of a BS answer, so I'm gonna start this video off with a pro tip. You can't go into your first IT job thinking you know everything. You also can't go into your first IT job thinking that you don't know anything at all, that you don't know enough. The fact of the matter is you don't know enough and you don't know everything either. Starting your first IT job should be a very humbling experience for you. You're going to experience many different things that you've never seen before and it's okay. It's okay to not know everything, but please don't act like you do. When you're starting your first IT job, it's extremely important to ask questions. If you don't know how to do something, if you are unfamiliar with the way something works, or if you're just not clear on something in general, ask questions. I cannot stress how important it is to reach out to your peers, your managers, anybody who you are working with who can help answer how something is being done. Every business environment does things differently, so understanding the way they want things done is extremely important. Rule number one, ask all of the questions. One of the things that I don't think gets stressed enough is that 99% of the time, you are going to be shadowing someone. And whether you are shadowing someone or not, you will always have some type of documentation, notes, ticketing system, or other information available to you in that environment that will kind of lay out exactly the types of different troubleshooting things you go through, some of the different scenarios and things that happen there on a day-to-day -day basis. You're always going to have something available to you learning new things about an environment based on the information that is already there. What good is rule number one though, if you aren't retaining the information? You need to be taking detailed notes often, as often as you can. Now you may run across scenarios and different issues where you're not able to take notes in that moment. Take a quick note that just refers to exactly what's happening, like one sentence, maybe just a couple words, come back to it later and get more information about what you just did and then take more detailed notes. The most important thing that we're talking about in this next rule is making sure you have the information you need. So when you're asking questions, you're taking notes, you're gathering your own information and data that you can refer back to at a later date. Now you're not always going to need this information, you're not always gonna to have to refer back to it, but having that information, having notes that come back around and put everything into more perspective is going to help you succeed. You want to make sure that you always have available to you the information that you require. So as you're asking these questions, you're taking notes, you're already two steps further in succeeding in your first IT job. The notes that you do take should be something that you refer back to very frequently when you're starting your first IT job. So rule number two, take all of the notes. And going off of rule number one, if you are asking all the questions and you just feel like you're not getting that information that you require, that you need just a little bit more, ask for help. It's never a bad thing to ask one of your coworkers, your peers, your managers for help. Get the information that you require so that you can succeed in the job that you're doing. And I encourage you, when you're just starting out, ask for help as often as you need to. It's not asking for questions, right? It's actually asking for more one-on-one -on -one walkthroughs. Give me a quick tutorial on how this works. Show me how you do it so I can do it properly. Ask for help, that's rule number three. And lastly, relax. You're there for a reason. Become a sponge and thrive in your newfound environment. It only gets easier from here. You got this.